M1911. The M1911 is an iconic American designed and manufactured pistol. This weapon has been a trusty sidearm for soldiers and Marines in all major conflicts since it entered service in 1911. It is rugged, reliable, and exceptionally comfortable to fire. Though it shares the same legendary creator as the HP Automatic, the 1911's manufacturing was done in good old US of A, making it a homegrown American classic. While the M1911 magazine holds only seven rounds, its 45 caliber ACP ammunition packs quite a punch. A single center mass shot can stop an approaching enemy dead in his tracks. The 1911 small magazine capacity means it isn't ideal for rapid fire or spray and pray. You've got to make each shot count, something that can be difficult to remember when in the type of situation which warrants the use of a sidearm. For clearing tunnels, the M1911 can be used with a GI flashlight. But be smart about light discipline. Having a light on always paints a clearly visible target for the enemy. Consider having a team member carry a 1911 with a flashlight for RT Columbia's bright light mission. You might just find yourself going subterranean. The M1911 can also be equipped with a suppressor, which makes it more suitable for recon operations in the bush. With some coordination, you might be able to utilize suppressed 1911s for quietly dispatching isolated enemy groups. But keep in mind, the 1911 is a pit bull. It's not designed for stealth like the Well Rod Mark 22 or HD. Don't expect to be able to use it for any type of camp infiltration or sentry removal without risking compromise. Legendary SOG operator Plastic Man points out that he never again carried a sidearm on recon after running out of ammunition for his primary weapon. A sidearm adds extra weight, and taking a couple of extra magazines for your CAR-15 instead could make the difference between life and death. That's something worth considering before drawing a pistol from S4. Ensure your loadout is tailored to your mission requirements.